containers, 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 containers. Look at my breakfast. Hello, I am Chef Boyardi. Breakfast is served. I think it's good morning and happy March 23rd. 24th. 24th. <laughs> I'm on FaceTime with Alex right now. She has some exciting news. But they cannot tell anyone and now it's stressing me out and I can't even say anything. I'll be right back. One second. Beep. Boop. I have something for you. <laughs> you have some good news. What is you the good news? Do you need? I have my hand moisturizer. I'm using it. I'm so sad, guys. My hands are starting to look like oh. 50 year old people's hands. Moisturize it. Add sunscreen. You can tell how old someone is by their hands that's and their I'm neck. Like, that's why I'm like, I don't like the, the all the hand. <laughs> the washing stuff. At least my neck is good. <laughs> Time to throw out the garbage. Ho ho ho! Adeline Claus here, ready to throw out the garbage. Okay, I'll come back for the boxes. <laughs> we brought over some yeah. stuff. I am going organization crazy. Let's organize the kitchen. Okay, let me show you. Let me show you. Look at this. We added to the fridge. Ta-da! Now, Meg wanted more drinks, so she got her little Perrier. Is that how you say it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And we also got these little cranberry juices. Look how cute they look all at the bottom. They're like little babies. Look at this is a regular can compared to the little baby cranberry can. And every purchase supports the National Breast Cancer Foundation. So cute. I organized them. These ones are, these are the five calorie ones, and these are the 70 calorie ones. I think I got the five calorie ones. <laughs> Like, I, you can drink whatever. I, I don't saw care. Check out, but I was like, uh. <laughs> no, you can have whatever. And then I got, I had these matching bowls. I think that they look a lot better when they're all matching. So we have our blueberries, apples, avocados, grapes. Dude, our fridge is so cute. I, why am I getting excited over a fridge? You need a syringe to make round ice cubes. Who the fuck would have thought? <laughs> Meg got a circle ice cube maker. I got these. I have a bunch of like containers, and I want to fill them with cereal. All cute stacked up. I got this big pack of Lucky Charms and my favorite cereal is Raisin Bran and I know that's really boring but I just love Raisin Bran. I always had it when I was growing up. Let's feel these. Look at how cute. There's still a lot left over. This is a huge pack. One cereal bowl down. I want to get two more and fill it with more cereal. I think, Meg, you got cereal too, right? Yeah. I have to get more of the containers. I only had those. It's okay. Mine has the same color as a raisin bran, so. <laughs> we need to get the colorful ones. I also have these containers. Sierra is the one that made me want them so bad. They're like little pop containers, so they go like that. <laughs> so I got four of them. And I want to fill them up and make them look all good. I need to show you something. It's very important. My drawers. <laughs> Look oh, it. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> Oatmeal? Mm -hmm. Bitch, this is cute. Right? It's like Khloe Kardashian, but like a really small cabinet. Lou, that's my ass. <laughs> this is what makes me happy. I know. Lou, what? <laughs> it's the, ball. Ah. the pink Lucky Charms are so fun. You can have it whenever you need. It's just so pretty. Whenever you want pink Lucky Charms, it matches your outfit and your nails. This is amazing. And if you guys haven't seen the fridge yet, make sure to check out the fridge and give this video a thumbs up. <laughs> Yes, we love organizing. Thank and if you guys are wondering, these containers are from Target. But to Meg, I'm like, wow, your reaction's like really fulfilling me right now. You are being sarcastic. No, I actually, your reaction's actually fulfilling me. Like, I live for, I love organizing stuff. Even, I was like, I felt like I already saw it, but then when I looked and looked deeper, there's just more to discover. And more to discover and more to discover and so on. It's a little life hack. If you want to make your cabinets look cute, you get little organizers and then you don't have to store it with all of the containers that they come in. If you want to waste your money, that's the way to do it. If you want to waste my money, that's the way you do it. Get some containers that no one will ever see. If you want to waste your money, I will tell you this. Get 
juice on containers to put all of your snacks. <laughs> Boy comes over, you're like, wait, I need to show you something. I know, boy comes over, I'm like, wait, before you look, look at my container. Nice. No, I'm like, do come here. Let me show you my container. Hey Google, stop playing music. I also brought over a couple things for my room. Wait. I also got a cute little basket with a blanket. That way it's nice and cozy. Gabby gave me this. I think I'll put Blue's toys in there because I think it's really cute. But I was on Pinterest earlier. I want to put some like dance boat photos of how I want my room to look like. But I want it to be very like bohemian. Like I still wanted to have pops of yellow but very bohemian. So that's why I think it'd be cute with like all the plants. I love this with like the accents of the brown and the wood. I was FaceTiming Alex and I was like, well, what if I painted like one wall yellow? Like just one. And she was like, Adeline, <laughs> you need to calm down with the yellow. So I think, again, I, my goal is to have pops of yellow, not an entire yellow room. So I think I'm going to have a collage wall of all bunch of pictures back here. And it'll be yellow, obviously, but I want to keep all of the walls white because I like it nice and bright. The mirror that I had in my last year, I think I'm going to put on this wall and then maybe a TV on this wall. But I don't know. This wall is pretty empty. I don't know what to do with it. Maybe put like shelves or something. Or you know when people have little ladders and they hang all of their clothes on it? I don't know, something cozy like that. I want it to feel very cozy. Not like work at all my old room it was so amazing and I love the way that it looked I was like very Casey Neistat inspired I was like I want it to be like a studio but this for this room I want it to feel very cozy not so much like a studio one thing that I learned after having a yellow room is yellow tricks your brain into thinking that it's the daytime so people with yellow rooms tend to have insomnia because they can't sleep and their brain thinks that it's the daytime like all the time and not only on top of that it was like a studio for me so I had like my studio lighting all of my cameras everything was like all everywhere whereas this one I just wanted to feel cozy like I can sleep here <laughs> and it's not a studio I'm really gonna miss that room though mr. Kate did such an amazing job like she did everything that I asked for and more like it was perfect but I think I'm just going for a different vibe like this is almost three years later I just wanted to feel a little bit more grown up and cozy blue loves sleeping in the, <laughs> the little window thing she likes to sunbathe she always sleeps there now you guys should check out her Instagram. I posted the cutest picture of her lying down like that. But also, some other things that I brought over for organizing. For my closet, I got these white little baskets. Because I think it would be cute if I had like leggings or something. I can like fold it horizontally. Or what do you like fold it this way? <laughs> so you can see all of the colors and everything. Because even though this closet is bigger than my other one, I feel like there's not as much storage space. So I think it'll be nice to like store everything down there. I also have my shoe rack that Gabby gave us. Some hangers. Extra baskets. But I think for my my vision I think it'd be cute so like once you walk in there's like I have a bunch of designer like bags that the bags come in like, shopping bags so I think it'd be cute to like hang them all right there kind of like on display that way you're like oh She's bougie. I just ran into the wall. Also, there's really nothing new here, but I saw on Pinterest people said to roll your towels and it looks like hotel towels. <laughs> I don't know, random. But this room has three closets. There's another one right here. I didn't put anything in here. I want to definitely turn one of the closets into a makeup closet where I keep all of my makeup. At first, I was like, maybe I could put my makeup right here, but I just don't want it to feel overwhelming. I want this to be very minimalistic. Watch me in like a month and my room is like very crazy. <laughs> so the hallway in between my room and everything. I'm gonna put these little frames up here. I think it could be cute. Cause so like when you take a picture you have the little frames right here. Still have to put up my headboard but this is how everything's coming together. I'm like really excited about it. I even like did a little sketch when I was bored last night. A hundred million stories and a hundred million songs I feel stupid when I sing Nobody's listening to me. Nobody's listening I just had like a vocal coach listen so my voice is warm I'm like, ah! But I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Today's tip of the day goes to Julietta on Instagram. Her tip of the day says, success is a series of small things. And I completely agree. Success doesn't just like happen overnight or it's this huge one big decision that you have. It's about the small things in life that you decide on. Like what time you wake up on in the morning, what you work on every day. Do you work out? Do you eat healthy? Do you focus on your dreams and goals? The small things. Oh my God, and look at this is the merch shot of the day goes to Alex on Instagram. She's wearing her hot mess and look at her dog. <gasps> ah! Ah! <laughs> so cute. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. I'll see you guys in my next daily vlog tomorrow. Same place, same time with you guys. Bye. I love organizing vlogs. I like literally, I was telling Mac, I like live for this. She's ever like, she's always like, do you need help like doing this? Like, I feel bad. And I'm like, 
May, do not ever feel bad. I live for organizing those containers. Oh, I, could, I live for those containers. Ah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.